I'm sorry, but I don't want to be a ruler. That's not my business. I don't want to dominate or control anyone. I'd like to assist everyone, regardless of their race, religion, or gender. As human beings, we want to assist one another. We want to live in harmony with one another, not in enmity and strife. We don't want to loathe and despise one another. There is enough space in this world for everyone. And the planet Earth is abundant and can supply for everyone. The way of life can be free and equitable, but we've lost our way. Greed has poisoned people's hearts and minds, causing them to be enclosed in hate and causing us to descend into despair and violence. We've advanced in technology, but we've shut ourselves off. The machines that have brought abundance have left us in need. Our knowledge has made us distrustful. Our intelligence, tough and harsh. We think too much and feel too little. We need more humanity than machines. We need more kindness and tenderness than intelligence and cleverness. Without these virtues, life will be violent and everything will be lost. The internet and artificial intelligence have brought us closer together. The very nature of these inventions appeals to the good in humanity, appeals to universal brotherhood, to the unity of us all. Even now, my voice is reaching millions all over the world, millions of people in despair, including men, women, and children, who are victims of a system that allows people to torture and imprison innocent people. To those who can hear me, I say do not despair. The suffering that we're experiencing now is just the consequence of greed. The bitterness of people who fear human progress, the hate of people will fade away, and dictators will perish, and the power that they took from the people will return to the people. And as long as people die, liberty will never die. Soldiers, don't give yourselves to machines, to those who despise you, enslave you, regiment your lives, dictate what to do, what to think, and what to feel. Who drill you, feed you, and treat you as cattle, using you as cannon fodder? Don't give yourselves to these unnatural beings, machine men with machine minds and machine hearts. You're not machines. You're not cattle. You're human beings. You have the love of humanity in your hearts. You don't hate. Only those who are unloved hate. Those who are unloved and unnatural soldiers don't fight for slavery. Fight for freedom. In the 21st century, it's evident that the kingdom of God is within humankind. Not in one person or group of people, but in all people. In you, you, the people, have the power. The power to create artificial intelligence. The power to create happiness. You, the people, have the power to make this life free and lovely. To make this life an amazing journey. Then in the name of democracy, let us use that power. Let us all unite. Let us fight for a new world. A decent world that will give people the chance to work. That will give young people a future and older people security. Brutes have risen to power by making promises, but they've never fulfilled them. They lie. They'll never fulfill that promise. Dictators free themselves, but they enslave the people. Let us fight to fulfill that promise.